do you so, uh, often check out some bands when you're on uh, when you're at home? Yeah, 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 totally. What, what's up? What kind of bands do we visit? Um, when I was home last, I saw. The bands. I was trying to think about what I, was I saw the Burning Bride. I saw the uh, fuck. I saw the Icarus Line. I saw. Are they huge? Are they getting bigger? I bigger? You. I saw PJ Harvey right before I left, like the night before. Seeing it with the Mark Lennon on a new album right now. Yeah, she, yeah. Really slow well. Yeah, it's a very slow album. It's beautiful. It's really beautiful. Did you? What did you check out? I saw the Burning Brides. I saw this band called Hella. Uh, <laughs> I saw. I, forget, I don't know. I, I saw the Mean Reds. That was pretty amazing. <laughs> what, what's really upcoming in America? Like, what kind of new bands we have to watch out for? Your genre, in the metal genre, punk rock genre. Darker My Love. Darker My Love. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, the Explosion. Uh, the Explosion. Yeah, The Bronx. The Bronx. I was at the Bronx. It was awesome. We, we, we got to take them to Europe for the first time, like uh, last year, and we did a tour in the States with them. Oh, I went and saw The Bronx, too, while I was home. Um, really? Uh, they're they're awesome. They're they're rad dudes. They're great people to hang out with, and um, their band is awesome. Yeah. You played with them in uh, December last year, uh, I think, in Amsterdam. Yeah, yeah, at uh, the Milkwake. Yeah. yeah, that was awesome. That we was a ate real, real yeah. fun night. Real fun night. Uh, yeah. The singer can be pretty uh, messed up on stage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he can be. Yeah. We all we all ate a lot of mushrooms after that too, after the show. <laughs> we actually were all on like a different combination of things. I think it was just pretty awesome. It's all fun though, you know. It's just like Eddie was so fucked up that he was filming something that wasn't even real. Like it was just in his head. That's uh, that's Eddie over there. It's it's all. F I mean, when you're in Amst for us to go to some place like Amsterdam, you know, and like you could go down the street and buy like some mushrooms, you know, it's like a weird, it's like a weird novelty. You know, it's like going to the. Do you like, hey, want to buy some? Want to buy some? No, we we just. Yeah, we we just scored it at the store, you know. <laughs> Which is more, even more surreal, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's like it's like going to the circus for us, you know. Yeah. Can you name some uh, funny things you see in other countries, like foreign countries? You know, pannenkoek. What's that? Pannenkoek, pancake. Oh. Oh. Didn't know the word? No. Um, funny things. Yeah, that you don't have in the U.S. It could be anything. Uh, really tiny cars. Sorry? Really tiny cars. Tiny cars. Um, <sighs> help me out. What's funny? Uh, What's funny? What's funny in Europe? Funny in foreign countries. What funny things do you see? Uh, the toilet. That's pretty funny. Yeah, that's Especially like in Italy, where you gotta, you gotta like do this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, why, I don't want to aim when I have to take a shit. Like, I just yeah, want to take a shit. Yeah, yeah, why do you gotta aim? aim? What if I miss? Yeah. The French toilets, right? The, the French people came up with the, the idea, the oh, funny no, idea. No, no, like the old, the old, old grannies and stuff like do that. Like they, they, they're all old and shit. They don't need to sit down. No hand bars. Like yeah, they got a fucking yeah. Wow. The different languages are funny. Yeah. Trying to interpret what everything says. That's funny, especially in Germany. I'm trying to read a menu. Yeah. Getting good at it though. Sorry. We're getting good at reading menus and dealing with because we kind of know what we like now. So it's just sort of easy. You just do a lot of pointing and you know. You, you, you make it too. <laughs> Again? A lot of burp here. Hey, uh, about the new music, because uh, it's been almost a year that the album came out. Um, did you write some new song? Is it possible to write on the road? And did you write some new song? Uh, nope. I don't know. Yeah. I don't write music, so... <laughs> okay, okay. Are there uh, songs in the make in making? I, I think some people can write on the road. I don't know, like it's... I think when you're on the road, I think the most important thing to do is to try to stay sane and stay healthy and to keep focused and, you know, doing what you're doing. It kind of takes a lot of energy. It doesn't sound like it does to, to people that don't do it, but it really does, you know. You're away from home. You're away from the people you love. You're trying to stay clean and healthy, and, yeah, it's it's kind of difficult. Yeah, what can we expect uh, from the show? Uh, 
Rocking. Rocking. A lot of rocking stuff. Yeah. A lot of uh, yeah. buzzsaw guitars, high energy sweat. Yeah. Uh, some uh, pick tosses, some backflips. There'll be some acrobatics. We all do synchronized jumping. Yeah, uh, um, but Tony does this like karate kick move. Yeah. I, I and kind of stole it from the guitar player from Good Charlotte, but. Oh, okay. But no, but yeah, it's, it's similar to that. It's in, yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.